Hello and welcome to this demonstration of a Limebrox Ideal coffee grinder. It's a vintage East German coffee grinder made in the 1960s. Um, as with all or nearly all Limebrox grinder, the adjusters on the top of the mechanism and the test is going to be the same as always, which will be grinding seven grams of coffee with the grinder on its finest setting and seeing how fast the grinder grinds and how fine the grind is. So first of all, we just need the, the burrs to be just touching. Well, we can hear that they're not touching there. So let's keep, let's keep adjusting it in, starting to get there, they're touching but not all the way around, there we go, so without further ado, That's 30. That's just about done there. So as we saw, that was about 100 turns of the handle. So that makes it a slow grinder. But of course, the advantage of a slow grinder is that it doesn't require too much physical effort. Let's have a look at this, this grind. It's quite fine. I think it's... Uh, It's not going to be okay for espresso, I don't think. I think you'd be okay with the mocha pot. And of course, we could slacken the adjuster off and get coffee for drip coffee, drip for a drip coffee maker, or for a even a coarse grind for a French press. So there we have it. That was the Limebrock 1701.